Now let's talk about how you can fix the iPhone mail not syncing with Gmail. So as you know, you can add multiple different accounts directly into the Apple's mail client. And the way that you do it is by going to the settings and then locating the mail application part of the apps list. So just find mail. It should be relatively simple to be found. So it is right here and you just need to go to the mail accounts at first. What you need to do is to make sure your Gmail account is active, which in my case is not really what's going on because you can see it's not even turned on, right? So I can enable it like that and then it requires me to log in. So the Google page is going to pop up uh, like that and I'm just going to sign in with my account real quick, right? So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to click on continue and essentially I just have to make sure that it's all set up right? Because I have to just go like that, make sure that I give it access to read, compose, and send emails, right? Other things are okay, the contacts and the calendar, but let's say I'm going to just keep it with the, with the mail. And right now the Gmail account should be active, right? So when I turn it on, it should work. And now when I go to the mail application, I can come back and see all of my mailboxes, and you can see that I have some stuff like separated. So I have the iCloud as well as Gmail. So it should work, right? It is now separated and it just works because, you know, I had to refresh it like that. However, if it still doesn't really sync, just open up the settings, return back to the mail accounts. And after the or below the accounts settings, you have what's called fetch new data. And as the name says, it is the way how the phone gets and retrieves new emails from the servers. And usually you can see that I have the push enabled. So as you can see, push means that new data will be pushed to your phone from the server when possible. So obviously have that turned on. And if not, you have the fetch below, which is like the schedule used when the push is off, right? So if you keep this turned off, the fetch now takes effect and this is you know supposed to be set up uh, in a way that makes sense so most likely you would choose it to be every 15 minutes so the phone can get the latest emails or even automatically based on your iphone's internet connection but if you ask me i would just keep it turned on and set to push therefore both the, the gmail as well as icloud mail can get the latest information whenever possible. So, so this is very likely going to fix the issue for you. Let me know below in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll catch you in the future uploads.